So good good evening everyone from Italy from the final uh, 2015 Italian Championship we are here for, uh, with Choppo and we're going to try to summarize a bit the weekend with you starting from the uh, criticism on the spirit that often uh, falls on La Fotta uh, we can say that you know just for this Paganello uh, you, we could see um, a video on YouTube uh, criticizing the uh, final point of the t uh, the final point against UTI, uh, how do you see um, La Fotta improving the spirit, and uh, do you think this criticism is uh, justified? Uh, uh, well, um, when I began playing, the Cus La Fotta was uh, was seen as a bad spirit team, and it was. So, um, <clears throat> yes, we were a bit bad spirit player, but now in this year with the great junior against us, we are improving our spirit and uh, we are trying to get better on this. But as I can, I can see in the European tournament, people are often more aggressive toward us instead of trying to be polite at the beginning. Because other team start always thinking that we are bad spirited player because we have this uh, fame on us, and uh, other teams needs uh, to understand that we are not like this anymore. We changed player, we changed the captain, and so <clears throat> we are trying to get even better. And uh, also, if uh, Red Bulls in uh, Paganello won the spirit this year at the Italian championship won the spirit and they they say that we don't have a bad spirit and they win in European tournament this could be a great pass for us to improve and to let the others see that our spirit is improving maybe we're not perfect as you can see in the video against UTI but we're just really nice yeah we're prodigal, really nice. Nice, uh, Bruno. Mine just stepped in the, in the interview, and uh, for for this try, for this try to communicate a bit of uh, uh, news from the final of the championship 2015. Uh, we are talking about the criticism about the spirit that you guys you don't really uh, created it because both of you are young and uh, you have to deal with the situation. But obviously, both of you are not uh, one of the oldest players in the team. Uh, what what do you think what do you think is going to be the next step for La Fotta for this season? Well, we have a very good team this year as La Fotta and we also have our younger players coming into the scene after this tournament, the Italian Championships just finished. And uh so we're going to our goal is to get into the top 3 in Europe and uh obviously anything can happen, but we have we definitely have a team that can play against any other yeah, team. We have great perspective for our team because it's the first time we're putting together youngs and old players for a bigger, stronger team. Yeah, it's a new team, new team. I'm glad, guys, you are uh, keen to start the, to do all the battle uh, in the international level, which are going to be soon on the VETS video channel. Uh, Subscribe to VETS channel. Thanks, uh, thanks, guys. Uh, as a last uh, question, I wanted to ask you: Is the this infamous case of the name La Fotta was uh, banned uh, at the last uh, World Cup in Lecco? And uh, uh, can you, Chopo, can you please summarize the the case? Well, the WFDF said that we had to change our jersey or cover our name on the jersey because La Fotta translated on Google Translate that as we know is one of the worst translator and uh, uh, translated it as a uh, will to F-U-C-K but instead in Italian it has a deeper and a traditional meaning like will to do something uh, above anything so it's different uh, of what the others think because uh, La Fota doesn't have any <coughs> any relationship with uh, sex or mean language or swearing so 
The problem is that WFDF uh, said to cover our name and uh, instead let like IDs mix the team with the let the, the the mixed team with the shit the word shit on their jersey and so I don't see why they could use shit and we couldn't use La Fota. I'm, uh, I'm glad we had the chance to explain uh, a little bit more of the Bologna slang uh, to the international public and uh, hopefully at the next uh, uh, international competition this name could be used and uh, thank you very much guys uh, have a great uh, weekend uh, if you if you can uh, and uh, congratulations again to be the Italian championship 2015 thank you Vets. Thank you, Vets, and uh, we'll see all you guys in Amsterdam, probably. Yeah, see you on the channel, and subscribe to Vets' channel.